Hello, this is Smoke Dragon 2. Yes, you haven't heard from me in a while, have you? And you can't see shit, can you? Why? Because I am in a I am in the truck as usual, but I'm driving around at night. Not even going to well, as usual, not looking at the camera and also not trying to angle the camera or anything like that so you can't really see but even if you could you couldn't really see anyway anyway I wanted to do this because I wanted to say I got a job career type job I'm Doing what I went to school for, drafting, and hopefully learning, hopefully going to be able to go past this probationary period and be able to get this dang job. Make it stick. I like it. And also another reason why I was wanting to say this was, or well, wanting to do this thing was, I just talked to a friend of mine who uh, his girlfriend is a super speeder. And anybody out there who doesn't know what a super speeder is, they like to go at least 20 to 30 miles, if not more, over the damn speed limit. I don't care how much in a dang hurry you are or how much you do not want to slow down. Don't do that shit. If you're going to be in a hurry and you know you're going to be in a hurry, leave earlier. That way you don't get in a hurry and you can get there on time, if not sooner. And don't be in a damn hurry just because you want to be the first person in line or the first person uh, to cut in front of somebody else. Or if you get to a stop so- if you get to a stoplight and all of a sudden there's no cars in the other line and you want to get in front of everyone else, don't do it. Especially if you're coming to a especially if you're at a four lane that goes to a two lane and that one lane over on the other side has to yield to get to the lane I say that because it happened to me I was in the lane that goes forward, stays forward, stays moving. The other lane yields to get in. Well, guess what? This other genius person didn't want to do that. So, he wanted to keep on keeping up, if not more, going more forward in speed and keeping up right beside me while I was keep on going forward. Well, I kept on going forward. And the next thing I knew, I heard me right beside me. My eye glances over, and he's like almost right on me. Well, I don't slow down. I just keep on going. I 
I just keep on. And so he's forced to lean back and let me pass. Well, that doesn't stay for long. He wants to try to get over into oncoming traffic, the oncoming lane, and get beside me, then try to force me into the ditch. Well, I still don't stop. I don't stop. I don't let him in. Because it's not my place to let him in. So, he's forced to go back again and get right behind me again. Well, this genius person wanted to follow me for almost the entire way back to my house. Ugh. Tell you the truth, I should have called the cops and should have actually gotten his freaking make, model, serial number, whatever. Should have dang called the cops. Anyway, bottom line is I don't care how much of, as I said a little ways back, I don't care how much of a hurry. How much of a lead foot you have. I don't care how much you want to be the first person or the fastest dang motherfucker around. Don't. Just don't. It's not worth losing your damn license. And then you won't be able to go to your job or won't be able to go off and visit your girlfriend or boyfriend or anything or your relatives. You'll have to call somebody else to get a ride. You'll have to stop and see what the Palmetto Breeze schedule is or whatever type of uh, transportation schedule you have. Anything like that. It's, it's just not worth it. It's not worth it. If you're going to drive, drive safe. can't see me, but I'm looking at the camera right now because I'm stopped. Well, sort of. Actually, you can still air drive. Uh, well, I'm glancing at the camera, smiling and thumbs up, but, eh, whatever. Anyway. Anyway, just drive safe. Don't try to cause a wreck just because you want to try to get more money or you want to buy up on another vehicle or something like that. Just wait. Save up money. Don't just be trying to cause problems for somebody else. Just because you don't like your vehicle or something like that. And don't be a super speeder. Don't speed for no reason. And even if you are in a hurry, don't speed. I mean, I understand emergencies such as, oh, my wife is having a baby. Or, or oh, I have a broke arm or oh I got bit by a fucking snake I understand emergencies like that but 
just because you're going to be late for your damn job, be late. Tell your boss that you woke up late. Fucking hell. Some people just don't understand. Just... Just take it easy. Just take things easy. It's not worth trying to speed and cause a wreck over. Anyway, this is Smoke Dragon. Signing off.